All right, guys, welcome back. I want to show you this old, uh, so right across the street from us here, if you see there is a, uh, it's an old service station here in Brewston, Tennessee. And uh, years ago, up until I guess probably the mid to late 90s, possibly, uh, that place was still open for business. And the original owner of it lived, if you see this double wide over here, they had a house there and it burned and, the, and they put that double wide in there. And, uh, but like I said, I think this place closed for good, probably back in the, uh, right back in the nineties, uh, maybe mid or mid to late nineties. I'm not sure. Uh, not really sure on that, but it was a, uh, it was an old SO, old SO service station and it had big blue letters up above the awning there or up above the doors that said, uh, happy motoring, happy motoring. That was the, uh, so slogan and it was in big blue letters uh seemed like it might have been uh i think it i think it had been an so for a long time and uh actually guys the thumbnail for this video is how that building looked probably back in the uh right back in the 60s maybe 70s i can't i can't really tell uh but that's an old picture of this place back back then uh when it was open for business but a young couple, a local young couple bought this place. Like I said, the original owner was uh, lived in the double wide over there and lived in a house prior to that that burned on that same lot. The original owner lived to be, gosh, like 96, 97 years old. And uh, his wife, uh, I believe she lived to be up in her 90s as well uh, before they both passed. So... They lived a long life, and uh, like I said, you run that garage over there. It was called Bogle's Service Station, and it said, uh, like I said, it had the uh, happy motoring above the uh, door where you see now it says J Key Auto Sales over there, and then above the awning over the over the door there in the little office area, it said Bogle Bogle Motors over that. Of course, he had some old gas pumps and stuff out there which had been removed long ago. And it's like I said, a tan, like a tan color building. And, uh, it sold, it sold, uh, the place sold at auction, uh, a couple of years ago, or maybe a year ago. And then, uh, it went into real estate and I know it was listed for like $200,000 and that was for the shop and the, uh, and the double wide over there, which I think the double wide is like a, a 2006, 2007, maybe a little bit newer. I'm not sure, but not a super old double wide, so pretty nice looking place. But this young couple that bought this place, uh, he has a mechanical background, uh, family members that own uh, shops and car lots and garages and uh, towing services. You see he's got a uh, rollback wrecker over there, so he's going to be doing some, some towing. He just put a sign out front that says, now open 8 to 5, oil changes, brakes, towing, and lift kits. So he's going to be running a business out of here. And if you can tell in the picture, he started painting the trim, the doors and the trim, uh, green. So, uh, and I, I stopped and talked to the young man, super nice young man. Uh, I stopped and talked to him about a, a few days ago and, uh, what he's doing, he's, he's a, he's a fan of, of the Sinclair, the old Sinclair gas station, I guess. So he's going with the uh, Sinclair colors of green, like green and tan. And so he's got to put another coat of paint on there is what he was telling me. And it's kind of obvious from looking at it, it needs another coat. But it's going to look pretty cool there. And if he can get some old uh, Sinclair signs and stuff and put up there, some Sinclair decor, maybe some pumps out front, that will look so cool. But uh, I, I just have a fascination with these old, old gas stations. I did a video of a super, super cool place. Uh, matter of fact, I got a couple videos, I think, on here on my channel of it an old service station that had been uh, refurbished and just it's awesome guys you got to go back and watch that it's down in ripley tennessee i'm sorry it's not ripley it's close to ripley tennessee it's called gates tennessee g-a-t-e-s very very small town look that up on this channel gates tennessee uh service station and that's a really cool video but anyway guys i'm just glad to see that a, a young local couple bought this place and that they're going to open it open it back up here and get us some business and we need a mechanic we need a place like that uh here in town i think there's only one other place up the road 
that does some similar work. They also do used tires as well, and maybe new tires too. I'm not sure. It's called Skips, Skips Tires or something like that. But uh, glad to see this place opening back up, and super cool to see him going with the uh, vintage Sinclair uh, look as well. All right, guys. Thanks for watching, and we will catch you on the next video.